You know, I, I think not really. Um, I just feel that Caleb is going to have to be able to learn to pitch in the highest of leverage. Um, so I don't know if it's necessarily the ninth inning or bigger games in the seventh or the eighth inning versus lefties versus righties. Um, you know, regardless of how that game played out last night, I would have done the same thing. Um, but I'm going to continue to give him opportunities. But I think that if you look back, I think that, yeah, there's some pitches that he's not finishing hitters. And um, I, I think that he's managing the emotions, and he needs that experience. But you know what? I, I just think it's, yeah, I just think it's like, I just want him more like, I think he's our highest leverage reliever. And so I think that everyone can, you know, kind of like, what does that mean to you or myself? Where I think for me, it means putting him in the, in the biggest spots of that particular game. And some nights it's going to be the ninth. And some nights it's going to be the fifth in St. Louis where I felt we needed to, or in Atlanta where we needed to win that game. Um, yeah. I, I, I do, I do, but I don't know if it's the best way to manage a pen. Because if he's your highest leverage reliever and, or, and you use a dedicated closer pitch in the ninth inning, there could be three or four days that we don't use our best pitcher, relief pitcher, because he's in one dedicated role. And you could argue that that's not the best for this ball club. So, yeah, again, you can look at it, uh, you know, 